If you plan on building a carport anytime soon, <laughs> or Jason, if uh, if he plans on renovating it anytime soon, you might want to hold off just a little yes, bit. Yes, or hopefully you saved up. Jason Carr is back, and Jason, the current cost to build anything is shocking right now. Yeah, and that land bank story never made any sense to me. Isn't the land bank for like getting people into houses and houses sold and moved along and all that? Anyway, prices for building supplies are higher than ever, and that's having a ripple effect that's impacting home builders and buyers too. The cost of construction right now is sky high. I've never seen anything like this before. With prices of lumber, steel, and other building supplies surging in recent months. Everything's way over budget. Um, there are projects being delayed. According to the producer price index, the sticker shock is historic. That index has existed for 35 years, and this has been the highest increase ever from April of last year to April of this year. Experts say a combination of supply shortages from factory shutdowns, increased demand, logistics issues, tariffs, and fuel prices are all to blame. I guess the simplest one word answer is pandemic, uh, that that has uh, caused just tremendous dislocations in the whole supply chain. Many future projects delayed or canceled, workers also in short supply. Industry-wide, we're about 300,000 uh, people short. All factors that are bumping up prices for potential home buyers. Just in the past 60 days, the market has tremendously changed. Lumber costs alone, adding nearly $36,000 to the price of the average new single family home. I feel like for somebody my age, I'm making a pretty comfortable living, and even I feel like it's almost impossible to buy a house. The construction industry hopes the squeeze on building supplies will be temporary. I think this is a demand supply issue. I think it'll be very short term. But for now, those breaking ground on a new build may also be breaking the bank. I guess fixing that's going to have to wait. <laughs> I don't know about you, but the pandemic brought out many of our inner Bob Vila's, the ship lap, the patio lighting, rustic barn, wood walls. But you don't have to be a pro to add thousands of dollars in value to your home. Let me help you. Help me. Help you. Help you. Monday at 6.30 on Local 4 News Today. It is 6.30 a.m. Simple and sometimes free home improvements that will pay off, and some don't even require that you pick up a single tool. So don't worry about that.